Hi guys, welcome back to Sunderland RTG. Um, we're at episode 13. So we're into April. Obviously we had a perfect month of March. So as we come into April, um, we have had a sale. Um, confirmation that Joel Lynch has left to go to Santos Laguna. So that's another player that's going to be off the books. If we look into the calendar, so this month we have five games. So we start away against Wimbledon. Then we have Peterborough at home, Burton away, and then Shrewsbury and Accrington to finish off the month, both at home. So I think we are going to play the Wimbledon game. Um, Wimbledon down in relegation at the moment. So we're going to play with our reserve team. We have obviously... Peterborough, obviously a big game against Peterborough. Peterborough not that far behind us in the playoffs. Um, only three days in between, or a couple of days in between. So we're going to put um, rest the first team, and obviously have the first team ready for the Peterborough game. So we'll play the first two, and then yeah, Burton are away as well. So we'll play the first three games today, and then simulate the last two at home. And then next month we'll just have two play games and then we'll have a roundup of the season. So as we come into the game, obviously we're two points behind Oxford and we do have two games in hand as well. So let's hope we can keep that good run going. So where we are, away from home. Obviously we had a perfect month last time out. So we're playing against the team down in relegation. So hopefully we can keep that good run going and get up into that automatic promotion spot and make it our own. Kimok has done well there. McLaughlin will go to Barley Mumba. Trying to get it back out there but they're in behind now. Barley Mumba is going to have to try and make up for his mistake. He's headed down. Wordsworth. Oh, he's come inside there. He's managed to somehow get away from us. And Sonny Layton having to come to the rescue. Could have been behind in the first five minutes. So it's a good strike. And Layton's got across and done really well to go get it away. Oh, it's a good whip ball in. Joel Lynch gets it away. The Wimbledon obviously fighting for their lives, really. Obviously desperate for points. Oh my god, overload out on this right side. Oh, whip it into Jackson. Jackson just gets challenged. We'll go back here, Jackson, surely. There it is, Archie Jackson. Nine minutes in. When we picked off that ball there, we just had... The whole team just pushed forward, really. It's a nice ball in there by Dobson. It comes to Watmore and then Archie Jackson. From about seven yards out in the end. Took his time, but then just slam, slams it home with that left foot. Got took out after the play, but it's a good start for us. Can Wimbledon do anything to get back into this Nick game now? Wagstaff. What more manages to get it away? Letting Shaw and Denver Hume does well. Oh, Dobson's took a took a chance there, trying to turn back. Dobson's done well to block it, keeps it in as well. Hume, oh, a bit of a gamble there, but it does well. Play into Jackson. Barley Mumba looking to spread it out there to Kimbayoka, but again, picked off. Oh, McLaughlin's gone a bit missing there. It's a good ball to the back post, well headed away. I think it was Joel Lynch that got that away. There's Jackson again. Doing well, getting his body in the way. Well, Grigg taking his time. He's got 
few options in front. Jackson. Oh, and he smashed it off the post. What a, what a hit with that left foot again by Jackson there. Well, well cut out, but it's back in again. And he's given a penalty. Joel Lynch. Didn't look like a penalty to me. Didn't. It just looked like he'd followed through after his shot. He's not even. He's not done anything there. Not even touched him. And here's the chance, and he's just Piggott has just put it into the left side by the keeper there. Left to the keeper, and the keeper's died the wrong way. After a good start, we've given it away a bit here. 35 minutes gone, it's now 1 1. I think just poor passing had started to creep into the team. Unnecessary as well. And again, was just short passes are just going astray. There's Dobson. It's a nice ball into Grig. Grig, it's a slow turn. Couldn't get the shot off. Feeling a big difference though, playing with his reserves already. Barley Mumba. It's it to Jackson. Jackson. It's a nice ball to Grig. We'll try and get back to Grig here, and we've got it through. Grig! It's off the post again. Already feeling aggrieved after the first hit off the post from this young man, Jackson. For again, not the best of passes out. Mumba. To Kimbayoka. Played into Jackson. Jackson, it's a good ball to Grig. We'll go back for Jackson now. Archie Jackson! Why has he gone for the chip there? Unnecessary. Substitution being made. I think we're going to have to go more attacking as well. We'll come to the last 20 minutes. A lot by Lynch. Dobson, it's into Mumba, into Jackson. I'm trying to get it through back to Barley Mumba there, but it didn't come off. Hume, good header down the line. Dobson, it's into Jackson, Jackson, Barley Mumbo, the turn, it's Will Grigg, Will Grigg again, and he's fell into Will Grigg, and Grigg has finished it, he's not been in the best of form, Will Grigg, oh, two bites of the cherry there, and he's managed to get us in back into the lead, so a game that we've not really played that well, it was a decent turn by Grigg, and he's even his final strike, he was struck pretty much straight at the keeper, but it's kind of dived, dived out of the way there a bit, Day. But has got us the lead. Go back to right here. Go down the line to Watmore. Watmore has come over to this right side now. Try to get back to Watmore, but it's a poor pass. Gives Wimbledon a chance to come back at us here. Oh, and he's a good ball through, and Sonny Lighton again has had to come to our rescue. 81st minute. Definitely don't need to be conceding again here. Bailey Wright gets it away. Played back in, though. Oh, and Dobson. Played straight to him, really. Right. What more? Bringing it forward. Played to Will Grigg. Will Grigg inside to Maguire. Maguire taking his time and then Sorensen just bided his time and that's just one ball through the middle. Thomas. He's out of stamina really. Couldn't couldn't break away. We are very lucky to get away with that. Just one ball right through the middle of our defence. And he was just in on goal. I think 
player was just out of stamina, just simply couldn't run away from our defenders. Oh, and again, we're just giving the ball away. Barley Mumba doing well to get back and help out. What more? Just need to hang on to the ball, but we're not doing a good enough job of that at the minute. But it is a 2 1 win. We're going to have to play a lot better though against Peterborough. Obviously, we'll have a, a full strength team out against Peterborough, but we'll, we'll need them to play a lot better than today. Wimbledon had a lot of chances in that, 10 shots. I think Sonny Leighton really took us out of a hole a couple of chance, a couple of times in that game. Where we are, Stadium Alight, big game. So both teams obviously looking at least for playoff. Um, obviously we're a little bit further down the road and looking for that last or the second automatic promotion place. But let's see if we can perform and get a good a good win against a team near the top of the division. by Gooch. Brown coming forward now for Peterborough. It's cut inside well. Oh, and it's a good turn, but Jordan Willis not, not fooled by it. Tony, I'm sure he, he had a good game against us last time we played Peterborough, I seem to remember. Well in there by Tommy Smith. Now it's our turn to attack. Well in there by Power, Power still driving forward here. We'll look back into Kyle Lafferty. Got no, no movement ahead of us though. Power, oh, Gooch tried to take a touch and then spin. Gooch again, it's into Lafferty, Lafferty, and he strikes it into the top corner. That's what we needed. It's a good early start, Kyle Lafferty. So he's under transfer at the minute. Obviously, we've got Magic coming in the summer. But he's been excellent in the last month or two for us since we brought him back in will grig not really not really been much of a factor since his injury and kyle afty that's now his 13th goal in league one i think that edge is in just ahead of max power as our top just couldn't get it into it quick enough oh that's a great ball what a chance now surely Keeper's done well to get it away. And we're just slamming away by O'Neill. So it is a throw. That's a good start to this second half now for Peterborough. Come inside now. It's Chris Maguire looking for that runner of Harrison. Just couldn't get down quick enough. Well done by Chris Maguire there. 71st minute. Just hoofed clear. Got to get somebody over there. We haven't. No, no, no. Come on. Fucking joke. Fucking bullshit. <coughs> I'm 
Just go in. It's Maguire. Surely now. Ball's not good enough. Back to annoying. Can we come again now? It's going. It's a good ball, Chris Maguire. Looked like he would got away for a second, but it's not enough. It's over here, but Mason will pick it up here. And it's a good ball. What a chance. Peterborough could have completely turned the game around there. <clears throat> nice ball into Chris Maguire. Maguire plays it off here. Josh going. It's going. Just close there. Why is this going? It's going back to Maguire. Played into Lafferty now. It's whipped out to McGeady. McGeady got a strike, but blocked. And that could be our last chance. Oh, max power and the game. We're giving away two points there. Shocking at the back for the Peterborough goal. And in the game, I think definitely should have won that game. Should have, should have put it beyond dark before that. <clears throat> so away, away against Burton Albion. Obviously a big game. Like we are one point behind Bolton now, who's a big competitor in the automatic that last automatic promotion space so they only managed to get a draw with their game so we need to go one better there here's Dobson Dobson obviously getting the start head of max power today trying to get Dobson Oh, that's wonderful by Archie Jackson. This boy is really starting to find his feet. I think he might even starting to work his way into more in a more permanent starting position in that cam roll. It's wonderful here. He comes into him. He obviously has gone on there to his right foot, cuts it back, gets onto that left foot, and there's no chance for the keeper here. Hits it hard and true into that far corner. Keeper no chance and we are 1-0 up. A good early lead. Archie Jackson. This is sixth goal in League One. So again with Taking an early lead in each of these games today. Obviously, we've then gone on to concede in each of the games in the previous two. So, we really could do with keeping a clean sheet today. Oh, that's well in. Well picked off there by Hume. Got a bit lucky that his pass got deflected, but still managed to find its way through to one of our players but it is quickly given away now coming forward they've got man in here murphy and he's caught back onto that right foot it's dinked it in and it's a soft goal again defensively we are terrible today yet again it's just a nothing nothing run really just cut back. You just dink this up and beat into it at the far post. Denver Hume not managing managing to get there. Ryan Edwards getting in front of him. Second goal of the season for him. 
Nah, good early, early start. Is it quickly wiped off? It's McGee. It's Dobson into Scoen. It's a big torch by Scoen. Behind us again here. Hume. Done enough. Willis to bring it away. Oh, let's go in. What, what kind of pass is that? We can't get back. And it's a good ball. And it's in behind. And it's 2 1. <sighs> what? It's just a ball straight down the middle. McLaughlin left on his own. I'm not sure where the what has happened with the defence this episode. Right, there's a chance. This is a chance now. McGeady gets it through. It's a good ball by Lafferty to Dobson. Dobson! It's getting fouled, surely. He's getting pulled back. And in the end, his shot has just got nothing on it. But surely there, he's, getting, he's got two defenders in his back, pulling him back. Nothing given by the referee. What a shot to McLaughlin. Having to deny them from taking a 3-1 lead at the end of this half. And again, another chance. Gooch gets it away. Just hanging on to try and keep it to just one goal at the minute. Hume plays it off Adkins and that will be a goal kick. Can we get a chance now? 2-1 down, so good good early start, but then defensively we've just been all over the place. Could have been even worse. Burton put a high press on us and really panicked our players out of the game. Here's Gooch to own the iron. And iron comes inside, Archie Jackson, Jackson. Inviting Dobson forward here. It's into Lafferty. We'll look for Archie Jackson again. We'll go near post. Oh, he's come off the crossbar. How oh, unlucky for the young lad. And Gooch trying to get it. Get a cross in, but it's come off the defender. What a chance there for Jackson. Can't believe it's not gone in. Kyle Lafferty here, the keeper, Stephen Bywater, it's going to be another, another corner. I'll try and get it through to Lafferty again here. It's a better corner, but again, it's just not going for us in the minute. And even, oh, Dobson's done well though to get it away. We'll look back for Dobson, but... Just not working. Good ball out here. It's just going to knock it into the box. And again, they managed to get there to, for the header. Oh, let's go in. into Jackson. Jackson, a good, good little movement there to get the ball through to Dobson. Dobson, it's got Lafferty away here. Lafferty strikes it in, and that's what we needed. Kyle Lafferty. In the goals again. Makes it 2-2. Two, two. <sighs> right. Can we now go for the winner? It's a good ball. And Lafferty took his time and just slams it into that near post. It's a really good finish. Gets us back to 2-2 two, two now. Lafferty, that's now his fourth. Dobson plays into Scoen, Scoen just turns into trouble and surely the keeper gets there but it's just poor play again. It's more we're giving chances away rather than that 
and the opposition are making chances. One more, it's into Grig. Grig. Oh, trying to get it through there, Maguire. It's got another chance though, and here's a chance. Dobson! George Dobson! Two minutes from time. Hopefully that brings up his morale a bit. Earlier in the episode, he had a he missed a shocker. This time, it's on his right foot, and just two minutes into for the end of the game here, and he's drilled that in. And the keeper come out to him, and he smashed it in his near post. Surely that's going to be the winner for us. We'll go full defensive now. Burton, it's hard on Burton. Let's let's make sure we keep hold of this now. Three minutes of added time. Can we force some back here? We need to stop him from getting the ball in. Fortunately, it's a poor ball, and we do get the win. And that will take us back into that automatic promotion spot and that could be a huge result at the end of the season. The game that we started really well obviously gave away two goals. Had very little possession. George Dobson gets man of the match <clears throat> and gets us the winner. <sighs> Please find a appropriate buyer. So we are going to have a problem with George Dobson in the minute. So his morale has gone up. Can we delegate a renewal now? So at the minute, I'm not sure what we can really do. Obviously, he's submitted a transfer request. We don't want to sell him. So at the moment, I'm not really sure the best way to go about it with George Dobson. Um. Connor McLaughlin has gone, he's gone to FCSB, so here we go in Fulham. So Fulham have come in interested in George Dobson. Dobson obviously complaining to the board that he's unhappy um, that he's, he's not getting getting away. So obviously we don't want to sell him, but we're going to have to negotiate and try and get a, a big fee here. So Obviously, with the last one, we went in high for uh, two and a half million. So I think we have no choice but to to do the same again, really. So if I propose two and a half million and see, because obviously Fulham, um, a much richer club, you'd say so. But again, they've just left straight away. So that's not going to improve Dobson's mood you would think but at the minute I don't think there's much else we can do so Dobson's saying he's been in good form so I'll say we'll consider it he's still unhappy unfortunately but I think we're going to have no choice but to continue to play him to try and to get his morale up really. Change the team around again for the next game. Um, Shrewsbury are actually in good form. Beat Peterborough last time out. But they do lose against us. Declan John, 90th minute winner. Not much else happening in the game but we'll definitely take that. And that does lift us back into second place. Dobson not happy that he couldn't play. Say so squad rotation is important. Proud of Denver Hume. Denver Hume's played well when he's come in. So now we'll skip to the Accrington in terrible form, lost the last three. 
And it's a one all draw. Jackson getting us the got the equalizer in the 58th minute, but that's looked like Bolton. Did Bolton lose? Losing 2-1 to Rotherham. Denver Hume has picked up a knock. So let's have a look. Yeah, so Bolton now are three points behind us and we have played the same amount of games. So with the last two games of the season to go, it looks like we we are pretty much there. Denver Hume just out for two days, so that's fine. So now as we go into the, the last couple of games then, so we've got Rotherham away and Doncaster at home next time. So let's let's get into them and see if we can finish off in this promotion but we'll find out that in our next episode all right bye for now